up, what's up, Cindy here? This is Tom, <laughs> my friend. So I just bought this Mi 12S Archer and Tom happened to have the Mi 11 Archer. So we thought, why don't we just compare the camera and see to see if like it's upgraded or maybe downgraded, right? Yes. <laughs> All right, just a little bit more about this camera comparison test. The Xiaomi 12S Archer, the first time you open the camera app, it will ask you to pick between like a vibrant and like authentic. There's no none of the above option you have to pick. Here in this video, I chose like authentic, which we think it would reduce a more true to life color. We compare these two phones in a wide variety of different scenarios. For each scene, I will first just put all the photo and the video samples side by side so you can compare and at the end, we share my thoughts about it. For daytime photos, both phones, I would say, are fantastic. But for the Xiaomi 12S Ultra, because of the lack of feather, it generates what most people would describe pleasing pictures. And sometimes the pictures are just oversaturated, like this flower. Now I'm working, just uh, hand the hold light. And this is Tom! Hey guys! I'm a cameraman! All right, so I will just oh, walk. Okay, walk faster, maybe. Okay, faster, right? Eh? Faster! Yeah, Whoa, right? Woohoo! I'm not running! For videos, they both have a really good stabilization in 4K. 60 fps but there's one problem for the xiaomi 11 Ultra because of that thermal issue caused by the snapdragon 888 sometimes the handset just got too hot and shut down by itself tom knows this well so tom you've been using the Mi 11 Ultra for a while what do you think about it yeah i have been using it for months i like the camera because yeah. it have the very big sensor of it but the very downside is the chip all we know it gets hot very easily right yeah 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 on the 11 Ultra, 10 ADB 30 on the 12S Ultra because that's the only uh, the highest resolution on the Xiaomi 12S Ultra. All right, now another photos. Both at net mode. Pedro! Yeah, the Mi 12S Archer is much faster as you can see. For net photos, Xiaomi 12S Archer 
process the pictures much faster, but there's one significant problem for the Xiaomi 12s Azure. That is, it got overexposed on the highlight part of the picture with the, on the normal or net photo mode. I tried many photos and the issue still exists. Now, my conclusion for the comparison, I have really mixed feelings about the Xiaomi 12s Archer. On one side, that one inch Sony IMX989 and cooperation with the Leica seem really promising. I like the Leica feature for food photos, but on the other side, it seems to deliver not that much. It even falls short for nano photos. I'm not sure if it's better than the Xiaomi 11 Archer regarding the camera performance. So, what do you think about it? Please let me know in the comment section. In the next few days, I will compare it with other top-notch phones as well. So stay tuned for that. By the way, Tom has a YouTube channel as well. I just put put them put it in, Link, down in the yeah. description. So make sure to subscribe if you haven't. <laughs> Thank so, you. Yeah.